I'm Ilian St. Hilaire and in this video we're going to talk about user idle timeout. So for security reasons you may want to limit how long the web page on Mesh Central can be idle without the user being kicked out back to uh, the login screen, basically logged out. And this could be very important for security because you could have users basically stay uh, on their browser, logged into Mesh Central for a very long time, and after a while, you know, somebody else could come in and, um, and you know, start managing devices they shouldn't be managing. Or uh, you could have sessions, users that are opening a remote session to a device for you know, overnight, and then uh, the server is recording that session the entire time, things like that. So what you want to do is, is either for security or for uh, data uh, you know, efficiency reason, you want to be able to kick out a user from the Mesh Central website after a certain time. And Mesh Central has a feature to do that. So let's take a look at that. I'm going to start with my trusty developer server right here. I have it manually logged in, uh, manually running, and then I'm going to just go log in on the screen here. And once I'm logged in, I can, of course, you know, remotely control this device, but I can stay like this forever. Uh, there is no limit to how long I can stay. So you got to change that. Uh, and here's how we're going to do it. So, uh, by the way, if you don't know this already, you can go into uh, the Mesh Central config schema.json and all the settings for the config.json are all here with the types and so on and so forth. And this file, you can find it by going to GitHub. Uh, actually, you can go to meshcentral.com. Then, uh, let's see, from here you click on GitHub. And you can go down to, uh, to the, where's the schema here? Mesh Central, um, we'll find it. Mesh Central uh, schema file right there. Click, and this is where you have the, the schema. So this is this file right there. So uh, once you are in a schema, you can search for user session idle timeout. It's an integer, the default is null, and it says when set, idle users will be disconnected after a set amount of minutes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is go to my config.json for my server right here. It's tiny and I have uh, two domains and you, this setting is per domain. So, and applies to all users. So I'm gonna say user session timeout and you can put, for example, 10 minutes and then you restart the server. And obviously I'm not gonna wait 10 minutes for me to get kicked out here, but, uh, but if, when you log in, you see no, uh, no change. Now, what happens is that if you're less than five minutes, you will start seeing a warning on the upper right that tells you that uh, the minutes you have left that you are idle. So what I'm gonna do here is, and actually put it, I'm gonna put it at three minutes restart the server and that's going to show us the um, show us that warning don't update okay so as long as i'm moving i'm okay but i'm not going to move and after a while if i don't move you'll see the warning on the upper right see here 3 minutes until disconnect and so if i wait a minute or you know it will start going to 2 then to 1 then at 0 it will basically uh, do the same thing as if I clicked uh, the logout button and uh, bring me back to the login screen. Now, in th this uh, warning will start showing at the five minute mark. So typically, you, 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 th this is designed for session idle that are more than five minutes. And uh, as you do things, so oh, you saw the two minute there, but as you move uh, your mouse or start clicking stuff, then that message disappears because it resets back. Now, in this case, it resets back to three minutes, so uh, the warning will just come, come right back. But, uh, but you can see that as I click here, uh, the warning goes away, and then it will just reappear, bang, right there. So uh, that's it. Very simple feature, user session idle timeout. You set it to the number of minutes, and you can kick out your users that are idle for too long. Um, there you go. So let's see, let's go back there. 
uh, hope you enjoyed that super quick video. Uh, probably not something I do on MeshCentral.com, but uh, on uh, general servers, probably a good idea for security. Thank you very much. Have a great day.